dodge the barrel, because if that blows up, I am fucked. Ah, that was way too difficult. It wasn't too difficult. Alright, this is getting ridiculous. Although, honestly, I think it's long past been ridiculous. It takes forever to kill these guys. Alright, let's plant the charge, watch it blow up. That actually can't do any damage to you. <laughs> and this always falls in the same way, every time. Let's see. Junk. Not worth it for me. Ammo. Junk, junk. I had nice ammo. That's pretty much it for this area. Um, not a hell of a lot more to do, in fact. Yeah, it's just it's just scenery from here on out. I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of find my way out of here. Um, question: Can you can you put regular chest instead of end chest? Yeah. So I then. Oh, yeah, you can use regular checks, chests, cakes, dragon eggs, and a chest. I use dragon eggs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> dragon eggs, I mean, they are annoying because somebody always right-clicks them. Always. I've seen you right-click the beast. I did it once. <laughs> I know, and it was I in the video. It <laughs> once. But... And I was even trying to axe as a hopper, so I wasn't being a dumbass like some people. I was just like, fuck! But I did fix it, which is more than I can say for some people. I don't go up in the wiring for a reason. Anyway, somebody always, usually Jaffe, right clicks on I never go in the wiring. And, <laughs> I mean, but the, the compromise to that is like, they're completely lagless. It's like placing stone to align the chest. Even particles don't lag anymore. Yep, what you want? Um, do ender chests like time? Uh, technically, because they have an inventory, but they're all the same inventory, so it doesn't have to, like, render unique ones. But So, no. Yes, but no. Uh, they should just make a, like, a block like that. Like, you can align for that instead of dragon eggs or under chests or chests. And I'm all out of chests. Or, um, missions. I was going to talk about like the different options I had, but I, I just looked and I have exactly one mission to do. I might get one, uh, a new mission in just a second, um, but I don't know. I'm going to get rid of the spy. It's kind of outdated already, especially with the double anarchy and everything else that I've got going on. Even this pistol used to be good, but is not anymore. And I was going to save this sniper, but I legitimately can't see myself using it. And every time I say that, I end up needing it. So I'm going to hold on to that, actually. What, 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 what are you going to ask me, Jaffe? I was going to say you should buy Portal. I already have Portal. You have Portal 2? Yep. We should play Portal 2 together. Played it twice. I, I played it like 13 times. I don't think I have it on Steam, but if you bought me it, I would play it. I'm pretty broke right now. My Steam account's pretty dull. Well, my Steam account is I don't know. Can you sell games on Steam? Like, could I sell people my Fine. games? Because I have like 54 games. Alright, uh, what about Portal? You should buy it on Steam. Oh, yeah, maybe. Probably not. Actually, that would be a fun series. I was think I was listening to a song today. And I got all nostalgic. I want to play, like, custom maps with you guys. Because I think that would be a perfect compromise. Because... 
High school is like dunking my head underwater every single morning. And then I get to breathe a little bit in the afternoon, and then I don't get enough sleep, so like not enough time to breathe. And then they just dunk my head back in. It's really torturous. But if we played like fun custom maps throughout the school weeks, that would be great. Because my Nerva Logs are just... They're fun to make, and I really love them, but I legitimately do not have the energy, especially to do that shit daily. Um, I only play Minecraft and I'm having fun, so if I'm not enjoying what I'm playing... I almost made a video today, and I was like standing there and I'm thinking, this feels soulless. This is... This is nothing. I, I was aligning the schematic, and I was going to build stuff, and I'm just like... I have the energy to do this. Like, I, I can just force my way through it, but I don't even think I'd make the video that bad, but it wouldn't, I wouldn't feel it. And every time you force yourself to play a game, Minecraft is typically the example, you end up hating it because you're tired of playing it because you force yourself to play it. So you need to take the breaks when you need the breaks, otherwise you'll kill yourself, or you'll, you'll kill the enjoyment, so you know, same thing, right? So this mission is actually pretty easy because pretty much every enemy is your level or lower. So all you got to do is kill them, collect their bottle of booze, and be out. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Throw Bloodwing. Come on, hit somebody. Hit somebody. I need the health. When it flies back to me, it'll give me the health boost. There we go. All right, got like 100 points. Whew. Where was I going with that? So yeah, like, I would love to do daily Minecraft videos. I mean, especially for the channel, it would be really good for me to post Minecraft videos every single day, but... Oh my god, I cannot do that. Even though I really do want to. <laughs> but here's the thing, Jeffy. Think about this. Oh, I you're talking to me. I've been talking. Have you been listening, at least? I've been listening. I thought you were talking to the video. Eh, here and there. I'll probably repeat this in a Minecraft video because right now I'm speaking to like one sixtieth of my audience. Well, I'm part of that. It's okay. That's good. And you're a minor <laughs> member. Well, a little bit yeah. more than a member, but like, typically I'm more open with members of the server. But yeah, to like, where's I going with that? Oh yeah, so like to get a decent episode, if I play like right when I get home from school and I'm like showered and everything. Typically, I'm online at about 4 o'clock, 3.30, 4 o'clock, which is late because I take long showers and stuff, but if I play Minecraft all day, you know, I play as much as I want. When I get engulfed in something, I want to just stay and play it until I'm bored. So this could run to like 9, 10 o'clock, say, say it's 10 o'clock, and I'm like, alright, I'm done with Minecraft, I need sleep. Well... If that's my upload for today, I can't just upload that. That's 50 random clips. I mean, like, I have to edit that. And, you know, to do it well and do it good, that's an hour to three hours. Right there. And that's if I'm dead focused. If nobody talks to me, I talk to nobody. I'm laser focused. That's that's a few hours right there. Now, back to Borderlands. Um... This mission, I'm not going to go to that area over there unless I need to, because I will be coming back in just a second to do the next mission that Scooter will give us. I mean, spoiler alert, I might be coming back later, I don't know. Uh, where was I going with that? So yeah, if it's like 10 o'clock and I'm like, alright, well that's the end of my day, well, I either edit the video and upload that day, or I get sleep. Huh. I wonder which one is more important. Uh, definitely sleep, because <laughs> if I don't get the sleep, then the next day I'm even more tired, and then I don't want to make a video again. And if I do it anyway, then it's, you know, lately it's been pretty good. Like, I have an upload today, because I, I, the episode went so long that I'm like, oh shit, I should just split this into two parts. Which, it really is the lazy way of doing things. Like, if I truly had the time to play daily, I'd have uploaded that 34 minute video. Fuck it. You know, I'm gonna be making one tomorrow anyway. But, you know, I need to keep reiterating that I do want to. I enjoy making videos. That's not the concern. The concern is the fact that as a human being, I do not have enough energy to be healthy. I feel like people aren't, like, always aware just how much sleep the brain needs and how badly it needs it. Like, um... What? 
What time do you have to wake up for school? Seven. Oh, wake up at nine. But uh, yeah. I'm always late for first class, so. All right, so I got the bottle of booze. I'm just gonna get out of this area, turn it in, because I think he's gonna give us more missions, which are gonna put us right back in this area. So, this filing cabinet, one of these, I think it was, I found my favorite gun I have ever gotten. It was a Crimson Cobra, I think, or something like that. It was a Crimson Red. Uh, crimson is a type of gun in Borderlands. I don't think I've really found that many, so I can't demonstrate. But it was assault an assault rifle. And oh my god, I called it Krista. It was like the perfect fucking gun. Oh my god. It was, laz it was totally accurate. It had like 98% accuracy or something. It was... 18 fire rate so it shot super fast even though it was a burst fire it was like it was fully automatic and then it did like 250 damage or something which was a lot like the one the gun I'm using right now is 50 per shot so that's that's a lot it was super fucking powerful shot super fast was really accurate and I, I lost it I think I used that gun in, from when I was a level 31 all the way until I was level 51 on a Siren account on Xbox. And at some point, it just wasn't doing the trick anymore, so I sold it. Who's Krob? Let's find out in a bit here. And that gun, I forever regretted it, because I played the game again on other accounts, and I was like, it would be really nice to go to split screen here and trade that with myself, because it was so fucking good. Oh, man. I forever regretted that decision. I think I'm going to get more missions, because I usually avoid Crom's Canyon, so I think Claptrap at some point here is going to tell me that there's new stuff in New Haven, and if there's not, I'm going to go there anyway. Come on, Claptrap. Alright, I'm gonna go to New Haven anyway. Because I think there are new missions there. I might be totally wrong. <sighs> anyway, I know it's weird to get attached to a gun, but it was just so fucking good. <laughs> and it looked good, and it was easy to use, and it was fun for me, and it was insanely powerful. But, yeah. Yes, see, right here. I really don't know why it doesn't notify you or anything, but I think it might be a glitch. Am I finally going to get that mission from this guy? Damn it. Also, you know what? There's another mission. I really feel like I'm missing something. Because if you run over here, there's another mission over... All right, let's go talk to Sean Stokely. All right, Claptrap finally told me. So Sean Stokely, I know exactly where he is. I don't even need the waypoint. He is back here. Uh, spoiler alert, he's dead. And he's gonna want me to get revenge by killing, what the fuck's his name? Um, it's, it's a K. It's a K, come on Jeffy, am I gonna think of it before I get the mission? I'm sorry, what? Comer, Comer, Crimit, Reaver. Wow, I wasn't even fucking close. It's Reaver. No, I know. Must have been Crom throwing me off. So this is interesting. This is really interesting. Plus five team health regeneration, and then all the perks. Plus eighteen percent team damage. So that's a slightly better class mod that gives me more damage, but I would be replacing the one that gives me a faster reload speed. <laughs> Should I take the damage, Jaffy? Damage or reload speed? I would choose reload speed, but that's just me. Okay. Because, I mean, the guns are going to get better and better as I go on anyway, but 18% damage increase, that's pretty significant. Well, yeah, I guess, but with me, I, I have terrible accuracy. You probably have good accuracy, so if you do damage in it, it'll be actually worth it. Although, how much does 18% scale? Like with this assault rifle, I'm doing 50 damage. 
plus 18% would be like 58 damage. <laughs> 